On wholesaling, the biggest problem uh, is, so you got all these products out there, like thousands of products. Mm -hmm. It's all marketing, sales, acquisition. No one had built anything for Dispo. And when you're trying to do a million dollars a month, if you're trying to do it all through email and your CRM, everything's going to slip through the tra cracks. There was yeah. no system out there that like tracked all your KPIs, managed your buyer's list, and gave you a streamlined experience to go sell deals. Um, basically, it was like, we're trying to create marketplace efficiency. There was no marketplace efficiency. I'm like, can we create a product that will allow us to have greater marketplace efficiency mm -hmm. so that we can move deals faster at higher prices? No one had built anything like that. And this idea of marketplace efficiency, that is not a common term. That's not something that's... No. So your background must have played some factor in that. Yeah. So uh, are you familiar with like algorithmic trading? Yeah. It's a giant scam on behalf of the <laughs> for Wall Street <laughs> against Main Street. But yeah. that's a whole nother conversation. Yeah. But so let's elaborate yeah, on So for is. people that aren't familiar, so... Uh, in finance, you know, back in the day, if you wanted to sell a share, you'd like be on the trading floor and I'd be like, hey, I got 10,000 shares of IBM. Who wants them? And then you would find another guy and like, and there would be this what we call buy sell spread. Mm -hmm. Okay. It used to be in the dollars. Now it's in like, now with like computers, now it's in like fractions of a, like 10,000th of a penny. Yeah. Right. Because the algorithms, that, that marketplace used to be so inefficient. But mm -hmm. then as soon as in any industry, as soon as you bring data and technology into that industry, at any two-sided marketplace, uh, what happens is your 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 spreads go down, and there's more efficiency, and the, more efficiency benefits both the buyers and the sellers. All right. So I saw real estate. I'm like, real estate is like 20 years behind finance. Well, I think you know your experience on, on Wall Street or in in finance, right? You saw that they were making E Trade was like 7.95 for a transaction, right? Yeah. So you kind of saw that that window, that that fee, that brokering fee is going down and down and down. Mm -hmm. And then you're trying to take that, when you got into finance, one of the things that played the factor was like, there's that gap is so small now, there's not as much opportunity. Yeah. But in real estate, there's this giant gap. And yeah. so when we're talking about Dispo, you're saying like there's this opportunity to fix with marketplace inefficiencies. Absolutely. So, All you gotta do is add data and technology. Yeah, so how?